In this video, I'm going to show you how you make your audio way more better in Adobe Premiere Pro without using any plugin. So without further any ado, let's jump into the video. So let's start with a microphone as we all know we need a good microphone to get a better audio so i really recommend you go with a microphone that fit in your budget and best for your purpose if you have a good budget then my recommendation is Bilu yeti all around Bilu yeti is one of the best microphone for youtube videos and whatever recording you want to make this is one of the best microphone i am currently using rode anti usb and this is also a one of the best microphone phone so the big question is actually your budget you can get a microphone that fit in your budget so i really recommended you go and search about some microphones that actually fit in your budget you get your mic everything is set now you keep it mind that you keep close to your mic when you are recording that is way more better to get a better audio because when you keep close to your mic your voice is clear your audio is clear and you're done with a better way your background noise is way more lesser than normal when you close to your mic so the next thing we need to focus on is background noise. You need a quiet area where you record your videos without getting any background noise. For removing this background noise, you can also use acoustic form that is actually a soundproof form. You can use it to decrease your background noise or the some irritating voice that your microphone is actually recording. So the next thing we are going to do is noise reduction. You got a good microphone, you remove everything that make background noise but still your voiceover contains some noise and you want to remove it. For that I'm using a free audio editing software called Audacity. Audacity is a free software you can download it from Google or I also mentioned the link in the description below. So I have a one recommendation for all of you if you are doing a voiceover just keep quiet for 10 seconds or even 5 seconds because when you keep quiet for 5 seconds we can done a magic in Audacity. So here we have a straight line that is no voiceover right here we just need to select this area go to effects and here we got an option of noise reduction and here you got an option of get noise software it just get a noise of your background when you keep quiet your background noise it just straight forward to your microphone and you got a clearly noise that we want to be removed now just select your all audio just press ctrl a go to effects again and here you got an option of noise reduction again just go with the default value and you can increase if your noise is too loud you can increase the value but i really recommended you go with the default value press ok and boom your noise is just removed from your voice over so after doing noise reduction if you still think there is some noise in your background then i really recommended you you can use music to remove that noise there are a lot of platforms that are providing music but i personally prefer epidemic sound epidemic sound is one of the best platform for music so if you have epidemic sound you don't need any other platform for sound effects and music separately you got it at one place epidemic sound is a paid platform but trust me it's really worth it they are providing more than 35,000 soundtracks with more than 170 categories and around 90,000 sound effects so it's really insane because with only one subscription you got all of this track freely to use in your videos so some people have confusion between free and paid music so i think so it's important for me to make the things clear yeah it's true there are a lot of website and youtube channel that are providing free music for videos but is it really safe to use so my honest answer is absolutely not because music that you download from a free website and from youtube channel are free until someone buy it because when someone buy the track you use in your video he obviously give you copyright strike or something else that really affect your channel beside that free music platform providing limited music and you don't have much options there but if you get epidemic sound subscription you have many options of music to choose you get whatever you want and you use music where you want so epidemic sound really worth it i mentioned the epidemic sound link in the description below must check it out by just signing up with epidemic sound you got 30 days free trial so i hope you will get the best music for your videos 
So here we are right inside of Adobe Premiere Pro. You can use any version of Adobe Premiere. It does not matter. So here we have an audio track. As you can see, we already remove a noise and here we don't have any noise at the beginning. And here we have a simple audio that I already mentioned. So first of all, we need to go to effects. If this effects panel isn't up here, just go to windows and here you got an option of effects. My shot, it will be checked. And now just search parametric equalizer. And as you can see, we got a parametric equalizer right here. Just drag on your audio track and just go to effects control. And here we got a parametric equalizer. We got an edit option right here. And here we have a main option right here. So here we have uh, some default preset. And my favorite preset is loudness maximizer. Because when you are talking, some points are louder and some points are may lower. So you think so, you need to be equalize everything. So here we got. Here we have our loudness maximize right here. We can done and they are just doing them default settings. So here is the after we got after applying loudness maximizer. In this video, I'm going to show you how you make your audio way more better in Adobe. It is way more better. You can decrease or increase the value of bass. Here is the bass line. You can just increase your bass. As you can see, it's way more better as well. You can increase the gain as well. Little bit like that. But still, there is keep in mind that our audio value is just between the minus 6 to minus 12. That is a perfect value. I really recognize that that's looking perfect so i'm just increase it as well so let's see here is the final results we can turn in this video i'm going to show you how you make your audio way more better in adobe premiere pro without using any plugin that's looking really good so now just close it and go to effects we have to search another effect as well so here we just search multi-band compressor here we got multi-band compressor just apply on your audio track go to effects control and just go with the edit option so my room is empty i don't have anything in my room my room is almost empty i have some background noise so i'm not going with a broadcast one but if your room is not empty you have something in your room and your room is just loaded then i really recommend you go with the broadcast you have a fully advantage of this broadcast preset so my room is empty so i really go with the internet delivery that is a perfect for me because i'm doing a youtube videos i'm not making any broadcasts so this is perfect for me and here we got apply a limiter because if you not apply this limiter your value is up going to minus 12 and your value is just going to minus 12 to zero that is a perfect value you can increase again if you think your voice is not much louder for your audience you can increase or decrease according to your requirement so here is the final result we got in this video i'm going to show you how you make your audio way more better in adobe premiere pro without using any plugin so as you hear it is way more louder so i'm just decrease the gain that we apply here in a parametric equalizer i'm just in decrease it to one and here we go so as you hear we can done it with the simple steps we are not applying some plugins we are not buying some plugins we're just applying some default plugin that are provided by premiere and we're done with a better way so here is the before in this video i'm going to show you how you make your audio way more better in adobe premiere pro without using any plugin and here is the after in this video i'm going to show you how you make your audio way more better in adobe premiere pro without using any plugin so yeah that's all for today's video i hope you like this video if you like this video give me a big thumbs up and don't forget to get a subscription of epidemic sound that is perfectly worth it i mentioned the download link in the description below you can use my code to get a 50 percent off thank you so much for watching this video i will see you in the next one